Yo, it's your boy Bleak Diddy Red back with another update on FBG Duck Murder Trial, man. It's day 19, man. And you feel me? I got the notes for the day. I'm finna let y'all know what was going on. You feel me? So if y'all ain't know, you feel me? Yesterday, it was exposed when uh, the security guard that reported the TZ we exposed phone calls. So today, you feel what I'm saying? We got a new person on the stand. So, you know, we're going to talk about how many times Doug got shot, FBI agent, oh, and, uh, you know, Los Big Mom taking the stand. So it's your boy, Blick Diddy Red, man. Subscribe, get in tune, share my music, share my content. You know, make sure everybody that use my content, they shout me out. Y'all know it's exclusive. So <clears throat> basically, day 19 started. Uh, FB, uh, FBI agent that specialized in mobile tower analyzation. He analyzed three numbers related to the case. One number was Kimberly Jones. Last number ended in, uh, well, her number ended in 6775. And that was Kenny Mack's girl. Another number was X5243. And that phone belonged to Ashley Wiley. And that one belonged to, uh, you know, Los. That's who was making the call to Los. And then the other one, last but not least, was Talandra Freeman. And her number ended in... 8070 and that phone analyzed from 3 o'clock to 4 p.m. But basically, uh, everything matched up in the courtroom when they showed the cell phones tracking. Uh, yes, these guys all had their cell phones on them, which is crazy. You feel what I'm saying? And they was able to show each pinpoint of them when they connected to the phone tower. And they showed their trail all the way from Parkway Gardens to FBG Ducks murder scene all the way back to Parkway. So, uh, <clears throat> After they showed that, you feel me, next was the Cook County Medical Examiner for the stand who did Duck's autopsy. Uh, he confirmed Duck was shot 26 times and the fatal shot was a gun wound to the back of his neck that came out the front. So basically, he got shot 26 times. He could have survived, but the only thing that did it is he got shot back here and it came out the front of his neck. That's how he ended up dying. So... Next, I understand after the person that told about, uh, you know, how many times he got shot, the medical examiner, uh, it was Los's baby mama who confirmed her name and her affiliation with Los, how much, uh, you know, how long she'd been with him. She claims to have known Los for 10 years and she gave insight on their relationship of, you know, how he was as a, you know, baby daddy, you feel me? So she basically brung up Zell. If y'all know Zell, he's the one that was part of the murder that killed herself before the Rico case happened. Uh, but she told how Zell was Los's actual cousin, you feel me? And how she knew uh, C. Murder, who was in the courtroom. And she confirmed that C. Murder was a part, you feel me, of the circle, you feel me? Uh, she also confirmed that she was with Los when he purchased his car. And when he took it back, she was, they had her ID. Muwap and Zell being with her and Los at the moment that he returned the car, we, he would return the car after FBG Duck's murder. And then the government asked her about, you know, the altered, the altered check stubs that got Los's car taken away, you feel me? Because, you know, I guess he, he uh, used her name, you feel me? And it came back horrible because she altered a lot about him having a job or whatnot. So basically her testimony it continues tomorrow. They're going to ask her more. You know, today was just an intro for her. But I'm on the bigger things, man. Let's talk about King Yella, man. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't let this one pass. King Yella was doing all that talk about butter for about a week, only for it to be found out he telling. I mean, Yella, it's out now. You can try to stick up for yourself. You can try to make any reasoning, but... When you do on to other people and then it's your turn, you can't be mad. If you claim to play all by the rules of the streets or the rules of the game, when you caught foul, you call foul, my friend. You know what I'm saying? But my thing is this. Don't troll if you know you got dirt on yourself because it'll be exposed no matter where you're from. And everything that's going on, hey, I ain't gonna lie. Everybody in the court looking defeated right now. You feel me? Lashina, you feel me? She got suspended for, from court for a week. She can go to the listening room, but she can't go in actual court. So, because of her outburst, 
when they found out Ralph lied, when they showed the recording of Ralph lying on that phone call. You feel what I'm saying? But, I mean, it wasn't a lot going on in court, but, man, there's a lot of niggas that's getting exposed, bro. Like, if Duck was here to see this shit, what do y'all think he'd think, bro? Like, I know he wouldn't fuck with this shit. I know he'd be like, what the fuck? But, I mean, I should have known there was something crazy when Billionaire Black and Yellow gave 600 Breezy a pass, but it was two of them and only one of him. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, a lot of things match up. You got to look at the people that's trying not to push peace also. Or do they live in Chicago? You know, niggas live in Arizona, niggas live in Atlanta, niggas live in Florida. I say push peace. The feds, the Rico is hot. This ain't the time to be killing, to be involved in no shit right now because the feds are coming from everybody. They're coming for everybody, no matter what state you in. Never say what the feds can't do. Because if they want you, they're going to come get you. And the system is not built for us. It's built against us. I don't care what you say. If you minority, it's not for you. You feel what I'm saying? Keep playing in these <clears throat> pale people's courtrooms. Shout out to the pale people, though. I got a white wife myself. But it's your boy, Blake the D-Red, man. Shout out to BG. Shout out to Blake Mob. Uh, stay tuned. Subscribe. I'm going to give you all updates. And now I'm going to cover some actual other cases from now on. Oh, and if you want to interview with me, or you know, you want to get hit me up on Instagram. Anybody that's trying to hit me up, hit me up on Instagram at Blake Diddy Red. Okay? Blake Diddy Red. Or follow the page at BG North Official and make sure if anybody using my shit, they giving me my credit. But I fuck with y'all. You feel what I'm saying? Check out my music. Check out everything at BG doing. You know, I'm the Duck, man. And I'm out this bitch. See you! Hey slime, why you crying? Heard a rat just told on your crime. Niggas be tweaking and don't see the signs. Trying to beat gang gang where they know they lying. Get caught but won't do the time. Catch you a rapper who you thought would ride. Cut y'all both shed nickels and dimes. We worked that block till your eyes would slide. Can't tell you why he switch up. Got that hard time soft niggas bitch up. Shouldn't go pick up stick in a pickup. If you gon' kill and you might leave a hiccup. You a rat, you gon' get stitched up. I done see the most gonna get clicked up.